Hello and welcome to Scam School. Today we're looking at how to draw 3D text. So 3D text, although simple, can be a little tricky, especially if you're going for a specific angle or effect, and it really helps designers when your scamp is accurate. So first, type your headline into Photoshop. Quick side tip, there's lots of useful buttons and settings in the character tab. You can set your headline to be uppercase, extra bold, change the leading, and a bunch of other stuff. I find all caps tends to look better in 3D as the characters tend to line up. Then make your text white and apply a stroke by double clicking the type layer and selecting stroke. Next you can hit command T to transform your copy to the shape and size that you want. Try holding the command key to quickly change the perspective. Alternatively, if the angle you're after is a bit more awkward to get, you can rasterize the text layer and use the distort tool under the transformation menu. This enables you to freely move each corner. Now, if you duplicate the layer by hitting Command J and selecting the bottom layer, then Command T to transform, you can scale the copy down to simulate depth. Try holding Alt as you scale down to scale from the center of the image. This is just a guide so you can move the bottom layer wherever you want. Next, merge these two layers by selecting them both, right clicking and merge layers. Select all with Command A and copy into a lightbox layer in Illustrator. Watch this video to find out how to set up a lightbox layer. Now you can trace the edges of the copy and use the image as a guide. Be sure to join the corners of the front and back layers and not trace the parts that would be obscured by the sides of the words. You can add a little shading for flavour and that's how you scamp 3D text. Thanks for watching.